everyone, my name is Isa and today I'm here to talk about the delay of an update about the game, some things I learned in the meantime and explain this title. Well, if you don't remember anything about what happened or if you're new to this channel, please welcome. My name is Isa, as I said. And I am making a fashion game. Plus, I'm creating it with you guys here in the channel because I really want to bring that connection between developer and player. I have talked about this in the last videos. In fact, this is the third video. If you want to understand the whole story, you can watch all the past videos that are here in the card. I talked about monthly updates in the past videos and why this didn't happen. Since the beginning, I told you about my intentions to be honest always and talk always the truth about what's going on with the project. Now it's not going to be different. Okay, but why this update took so long? Simple, because we are not making the game. The development of the game is paused and why we stop nothing happened with our group we're fine and still four people and we all study together and we all work and the fashion game is an extra project is not on any of our college projects or work projects unfortunately we are in the end of the semester and with the quarantine we thought that we would have more time to work on the fashion game but it didn't happen like that, we still are having classes, online classes, and we still have a lot of work to do. But when next month arrives, July is the month of our vacations, we will have more time. And I'm saying this for all of my teammates, we already agreed on this. We are going to work really hard on the game when July arrives, but we need your help to every step of the way. Maybe more videos about the game will be posted, maybe, I can't promise anything. As soon as the vacation starts, we will jump right in on the project. Now, what about this business plan that is in the title? To be honest, I never wanted to stop working on the project, but things are never the way we want them to be. So, I was searching for ways to work on the project, even if it was from far away, even if that didn't mean to literally put my hands on the keyboard and code the game. I took a business class in the college and we have to create this huge project kind of like a startup and I was determined to make the game in this project. Sorry teacher, I wasn't supposed to say that, this is a part of school project but I combined the two things together and I'm taking this project very seriously, I'm making it on my own to use the fashion game as a subject. My team is not having the same class but they are helping me with some stuff and this class opened my eyes and I saw that I was doing lots of wrong things. Wanting or not, we are developing a company, a game studio. We even chose the name of our little indie studio, the Empress. This tarot card was our inspiration for the name and all that she means. With the class, I saw that we could have planned everything better before we really start the development of the game. We have to test some things, we have to talk with you guys, because maybe I'm liking something and you're not, so we need to test everything in the best way possible. I have business plans, canvas about the game, so everything is coming to life. I had to think about what I want and what is my goal. Nothing is 100% clear yet, but it's something already. Before, we were just making things, and that is not the way to begin. And today I didn't came here with empty hands, you have some work to do. I really need your help, please help us to choose some things for the beginning of the game. I already was going to test this out, but I realized that I didn't have to put my team to work for weeks, so we did a MVP. We did a minimum viable product of voting based on the new game stylish, if don't know it's okay. So it's based on quarterfinals. I really like it, this voting, so I want to know what you guys think. It's a longer voting, but it gives us more data. So I need you to click on the link down below and vote. I'm going to show you exactly how you can participate. As soon as you click in the each I.O. link, this page will open. The forms are in Portuguese and English, that's why there is two videos, one in English and the other one in Portuguese. Then you click in Run Game, your screen will turn, you click in OK and Hold. I need you guys to do two things, one is participate in this voting, the other one is answer the form that is also in the description box. 
Quarterfinals, I need you to analyze and vote in the look that you most identify or like. Then you just click on the look that you enjoyed. It's going to change quickly which one I like the best. So you just need to finish the voting. I'm going to click randomly. Vote seriously, okay? So this looks the winner and now you are going to answer the form. You can click in the website page or in the description box. Here is the link to the forms. It has a few questions. You are going to select the winner of your voting. Mine was steampunk. Then you are going to answer about the voting mode. You are also going to answer me what you like to see in a fashion game. And last, what you miss the most in a fashion game. This question is not mandatory. This is all we need and you can send this form. Please help us, this is extremely important to the development of the game. I'm really grateful for everyone that participates and I'm open to feedbacks and comments and ideas. But this is all we have, ideas. A hundred things to do and ideas. And we have to start somewhere. We have to start testing things. Maybe when we launch the game, maybe a year from now, it's not complete, it's not a full game, so we can have feedbacks. Until now, we don't have any investments, we are not asking for money, that is not the focus right now. When we need, we can do like Paralives, the competitor of The Sims, create a Patreon and everything, but now it's not the focus. We just want you to vote and answer the research. I hope you enjoyed this video, sorry for the delay, and bye!